Is your Ubuntu system feeling slow or laggy? Don't worry. You don't need a new laptop. In this video, I'll show you how to speed up Ubuntu with a few powerful tweaks that are easy to apply, even if you're new to Linux. Stick around till the end because the last tip alone can give your system a huge performance boost. Let's dive in. First, disable unnecessary startup apps. When Ubuntu boots, a lot of background apps start automatically, and many of them you probably don't even use. These slow down your startup time and eat up RAM. To fix this, search for Startup Applications in your app menu. Uncheck any apps you don't need starting up every time you log in, like Bluetooth Manager, Screen Sharing, or Software Updaters. Disabling just a few can dramatically reduce boot time. Second, clean junk and unused packages. Ubuntu collects system junk, like old cache, logs, and unused dependencies over time. Open your terminal and run. Pseudo app clean. Pseudo app auto remove pseudo journal CTL. Vacuum time equals three. This clears unnecessary files, frees up space, and can help your system feel lighter and faster. Third, use a lightweight desktop environment. The default GNOME desktop is beautiful, but pretty heavy, especially for older hardware. You can switch to a lightweight environment like XFCE or LXQT. Run sudo apt install Zubuntu desktop after installation, log out and choose XFCE at the login screen. You'll be surprised how much faster things feel. Fourth, reduce swappiness. By default, Ubuntu starts using swap memory way too early. Swap is stored on your hard drive, and it's much slower than RAM. To change this behavior, reduce the swappiness value from 60 to 10. Run sudo vm.swappiness equals 10. Then, to make it permanent, echo vmm swappiness equals 10. Pipe sudo t-a slash etc. Sistle.conf. This makes Ubuntu rely more on RAM, speeding up multitasking and general performance. Fifth, install preload. Want your favorite apps to open faster? Install a tool called Preload. It analyzes what apps you use most and preloads them into memory. Run. Pseudo apt install preload. Once installed, it works silently in the background. No extra setup needed. Simple and effective. Sixth, analyze and optimize. Boot time. You can analyze what's slowing down your boot with System Analyze. Run. System Analyze. It shows you the total time your system takes to start. To see a breakdown of services, System Analyze blame. If Bluetooth or printing services are taking too long and you don't use them, disable them. Pseudo system CTL, disable Bluetooth. Service. Just make sure you don't disable anything critical. Seventh, use faster update mirrors. Ubuntu downloads updates from its default servers, which may not be fastest for your region. To speed things up, switch to a local mirror. Go to software and updates, then Ubuntu software tab, then download from. Click select best server, Ubuntu will run a quick test and choose the fastest one for you. Eighth, disable animations. Ubuntu's visual animations can look nice, but they slow things down, especially on older hardware. To turn them off, install GNOME Tweaks, sudo apt install GNOME Tweaks, then open Tweaks, Appearance, and turn off Animations. You'll instantly notice your desktop feels snappier. Ninth, keep your system updated. This one's simple but powerful. Make sure your system is always up to date, Updates bring bug fixes, performance boosts, and security patches. Run sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade. Doing this regularly ensures your system stays fast and secure. And that's it. With these nine tweaks, your Ubuntu system should feel much faster from boot up to daily usage. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, share it with a fellow Linux user, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more tech tips, Linux hacks, and performance guides every week. Thanks for watching and enjoy your faster Ubuntu.